Hello, so it is best to look at game engines like tools. Each one has their uses, their own pros and cons, features and flaws, and choosing one of the many engines just depends on the project idea in your mind. So if you don't have a clue of what sorts of projects you want to work on, then it is going to be difficult to select the right tool for said job. Whether that be 2D or 3D, open world or level based, mobile or not, team of developers or solo, or maybe you're a new developer, and so on. I recommend pausing this video now and making a complete list of what you need from a game engine that will be most beneficial to your personal needs in your own game dev journey. Once you have this list all sorted out, we can move to the next section of choosing the perfect engine for us. So now let me list out the pros and cons of the four major game engines, Unity, Unreal, Godot, and Game Maker, and we can see how your list compares with these engines. We will start with Unity. Some of the pros are the powerful 3D abilities, uses the widely known C Sharp language, huge community with tons of online tutorials, the huge asset store available, and the better cross-platform integration. Some of the cons are the user interface can be intimidating to new users, the engine large size can cause slowness on some devices like laptops or lower in PCs, and it can be expensive if you need all the features. Now ask yourself how your list compares to the pros and cons of Unity. Now I'll be sure to compare these engines more with each other later on in this video. But let's move into Unreal. Some of the pros are the powerful 3D abilities. It uses the widely known C++ language, which is most efficient for large data processing if you need that. It produces stunning realistic graphics, friendly for non-programmers with the use of things like blueprints and AI behavior chains, and the source code is available to the public. Some of the cons are not great with 2D or mobile games, the documentations aren't great at all, and it can be overcomplicated sometimes. So now ask yourself, how does your list compare with Unreal? But now, Godot. Some of the pros are the powerful 2D ability it is the best engine in my opinion for 2D development, a simple easy to learn language which was created to work perfectly with the engine called GDScript along with the easy to use engine interface. Small but quick lightweight engine, perfect for laptops and all PCs. It is completely free and open source. The fast growing community is full of online tutorials to get started. And really those are just some of the pros. But some of the cons are the limitations with 3D, the current physics engine but this can be improved by just installing Jolt, and I guess the limited graphic capabilities when compared to Unity and Unreal. Lastly game maker. Some of the pros are user-friendly interface, 2D development, and easy to learn. Some of the cons are the limited flexibility, the inefficient performance, and the cost. So after looking at all the engines, which engine looks like it matches best with the list you created? If you are still unsure, then drop a comment about your specific needs in the comments and I will be sure to get back to you with my opinion on the best engine for you. If you're trying to decide between Unity and Unreal, then I recommend Unity just for the ease of access with free tutorials based around the engine, but if you're looking for the best possible graphical result, I would go with Unreal. If you're trying to decide between Godot and GameMaker, then I recommend Godot because Godot is growing rapidly and has both 2D and 3D, and once you get the hang of Godot, it becomes a faster and easier tool overall. It is also completely free, the scripting language is much better in Godot than GameMaker, and the Godot team has much more passion for the engine, as GameMaker seems to be currently fizzling out. Game dev is an amazing journey, full of fun and exciting experiences. You just need to pick an engine and get started. I started with Unity and have since moved to Godot, and have been developing in Godot for about 5 years now. I really do recommend it over all others, and if you want to get started, I have created so many tutorials to help you in Godot over the past couple years. I hope this video was able to help you better understand the 4 main game engines, and hopefully find one that fits your needs perfectly. Remember, if you are still unsure, then let me know in the comments and I will give you my opinion on the best game engine for your needs. And until next time, stay safe and have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. Bye-bye.